Hello, hello, beautiful people. Welcome to episode number six. If you guys missed any of the previous episodes, there's going to be the playlist on the top of the description. Definitely go ahead and check it out. Uh, but to start this video off, I do want to AFK on sand crabs. And in the previous video, I AFK on sand crabs. And you guys told me that I can take a task of sand crabs. So let's see if that is actually a thing. I went through this list so many times and I've never found sand crabs. So worms, no. And that druid, no troll, no temple, no sulfur steel, moss giants, jellies, iron, hill. Giants, Hellhounds, Greater Demons, Fire Giants, Dagonoff, Blue Dragons, Bloodveld, Black Demons, Banshee, and Clever Inspectors. As you can see, there is no sand crabs on this list, and I get hundreds of comments telling me just take sand crabs for the task. They're literally not on the list. What am I supposed to do? Um, but, anyways, with that being said, I'll go AFK sand crabs again. Many hours later, 93 fishing. At the moment, we're also 69 agility and 68 strength. Nice. We are currently working on 60% Hosidious favor on our Slayer account and you may be wondering why are we doing that and well the reason we are doing it is so we can create attack potions our super attack potions, super strength potions and prayer potions. Those are the three types of potions that this account is going to need and in order to do that the easiest way to do it is just to do uh, the farming guild but in order to enter the farming guild you need 60% Hosidious. We just got 45 with the 300 fertilizer that we just did and we're gonna do mass hole really quickly until we are 60%. And here we have it. I was waiting for this one before I go and complete all these clue scrolls and with just 220 feathers left to go, 95 fishing is pretty much the max we can get. So the first thing I need to do next is get my ranged up. Get my prayer to 43 so I can actually kill the wizards when I, when I do the clue scrolls. And uh, yeah, should be honestly fairly easy. We're gonna go ahead, knock the range out of the way and uh, get prayer in the process. Alright, so here is the plan. I'm gonna start off by completing easy clue scrolls and medium clue scrolls uh, because they can give me some range equipment that will speed up my range training. After that, we're gonna get ourselves 43 prayer and, well, whatever range level we get on hill giants. And after that, we will then complete all the hard clue scrolls and the elite clue scrolls. So, I'm pretty excited to do this. Hopefully, we get something good. And, uh, yeah, I guess let's just start off with 10 easies. Apparently, thanks to my Twitch chat, someone suggested that I should be doing mediums and easies at the same time. I can't do hards yet because of my stats. So if I quickly search for medium, now I have two clue scrolls. For example, for medium, oh fuck. Very quickly, while we're in the process of completing our fifth easy clue, I will also accept the mimic challenges. That will come in handy for the future though. Alright, here we go. First five easy caskets on the account. Let's see if we can get something good. Studded chaps, this is already amazing, cause, yeah, and then Amulet of Magic, I guess that's my best in slot magic amulet already from the first one, that's really good. The second one, we got some Morton teleports, wait, let's see if we can teleport out, oh, it was worth a try. Um, we have three more, oh, we can fashion scape, yes, bronze played body G, I'll take it, and this was pretty shit, and this was... Uh, I have all these bows already. Look at me, man. I'm actually a warrior. Nice. I'm happy. And round two. Five more easy clue scrolls. Let's see what we get. Still full empty. Looking really interesting. Okay, good start. Another one of uh, the magic. Don't need that. Ooh, studded body. That's gonna be perfect for our range training. See, that's what I had in mind. That's why I wanted to do those first. Um, Stuff of air. And I'm actually gonna... Just throw that in the bank real quick here. Alright, one more. Oh my god, blue skirt G. Oh, and 12,000. What? That is so much money for like an easy clue scroll. And that looks so good. When we're training magic, we, we, we ball out in these robes. It's actually so insane. If we take a look at our fashion scape right now, we have... Uh, we have everything. We can literally ball out like this. <laughs> we look like an idiot actually. Alright, that's I'm really happy. That's that's so funny actually. Nice. Here we go, another book of knowledge. We're gonna put it over on Hunter on this account. We wanna get that up very easily with these books. And there we go, a couple of levels to 26. Very nice. Apparently I got trolled a little bit and there is actually no store that sells me these items So we're gonna have to drop them and hope for the adamant stuff from the actual medium clues themselves So if we drop this clue open a new one, what is it? <laughs> <laughs> oh my 
great! Dude! I just got a task of 77 Mosh Giants, so that's gonna give me decent Slayer XP, decent range XP, and most importantly, we're gonna get some prayer XP as well. Alright, here we have it, 30 Slayer, ladies and gentlemen. We are, uh, uh, you know, shooting these. We're gonna be shooting these for a while. I have 50... What is this? 56 left on the task, I think. Um, and the range level is now 45. I do wanna get 50, but holy... Prayer is actually so slow. How am I gonna get 37? I think by doing insult the giant heads, but for that I'll need 60% RCS. So I think that's gonna be the detour when we get to that point where we finish the task, where we get in enough insult heads pretty much, but... Yeah, definitely a bit of a grind. I underestimated how long this was gonna take because I have the relic on the other account and prayer is like so fast. Uh, but we're gonna make it work, it's fine. Well, as you can see, we are already 95 strength on our AFK slash Slayer account and I'm like rank 3 strength right now. I'm gonna go all the way to 99 because doing tasks with Rune Scimitar is pretty annoying. So, but if I get to 99 strength and maybe 99 attack here, I mean, I have intentions of going to post 99 XP anyways. I might as well AFK here a bit and then do Slayer on a later date and uh, yeah, it's looking pretty good. 87 HP already. I am very happy with how things are going. Well, well, this task with Iron Arrows definitely took very, very long to complete. I think I'm done. Yeah, yeah I'm done. Two tasks in a row completed on the account. Uh, I just want to quickly see how much XP I actually get for the book. So if I read it and... Okay, it's 627 for magic. It's not as much as I thought, huh? But it's only four for runecrafting. And I think it's like... It's literally like the only way of training runecrafting. Oh, I wish I used my lamp on this. Oh, well. Um, let's get 4 x Oh, wait, it's 20 XP. Hold on, let's see. Boom, 20, and then 40. Okay, it's gonna go fast. Then 60, then 100. Alright, we're gonna be fine. We're already level 4. Wait, hold up. I don't know why did it, I didn't realize that, but it says 16 XP and I'm getting 100. So if it says 600, how much do I actually get? 3,000. Okay, now this is a bit different. I'm still gonna use them, obviously, on runecrafting because I wanna get that up. But you can use this method and get like insane uh, magic XP, I think. This is so good though. Look at this, we're already getting 500 XP, we're level 15. We do want to get that to 20 pretty much. Oh wait, I have one more here. Boom. Thank you. Let's see if this is gonna be enough. As you can see, I'm 97.5% right now. And yes, we got lucky, that's 100%. Let's claim more XP in runecrafting. Just like so, thank you very much. 21 and that's gonna be base 20 stats and level 20 runecraft and friend of the house Arceus And that's a bunch of tasks completed right there if I claim uh, we're on 1960 all the way down to 1840 very nice. I'm gonna use the rest of the books that I have, I'm unfortunately gonna drop the rest because I wanna do something else. So right now the next plan that I'm gonna be doing is I'll first go ahead and see what my new task is. And then if my new task is kind of bad, I'm gonna go and do some heal giants. We still need to get the 37 prayer for now. Alright, very quickly let's check the task. Temple spiders. Yeah, I'm not doing that, that's for sure. Not right now at least. So that means... We are left with hill giants. Let's go ahead, grind some hill giants, get some insult heads, and uh, finish this 37 prayer already, man. Well, since I'm leaving this account on the side, it is bound to happen, but I just achieved 97 strength, and we are getting extremely close to 99. Currently, there is only one person with 99 uh, strength, and that is pretty amazing to see, knowing that I'll probably be the second, and you know what, we can get a little bit more experience and get to that, that rank one very, very easily. Also, I've been collecting these caskets, they usually drop some uncuts and whatnot. There we go, perfect, so that's gonna be some easy crafting levels if I decide to do so. Um, but yeah, very happy, two more levels to go, I'm gonna grind this out on the sand crabs, and then I'll get all my other stats up on the actual Slayer monsters. I keep forgetting how broke this account is, it's really really sad how broke I am, but 3200 experience for each insult head, and as soon as we can complete one heart clue, we are literally gonna have enough money to do anything, hopefully, because we can like get rune stuff, we can alt them and so on and so forth. But for now, I have six more animations to do and my prayer should easily reach level 37. And we are out of runes, but we did end up getting, uh, I guess, 42 prayer after this kill. So that is very nice. I think I can now go ahead and complete some hard clues, get some money. Finally, oh, you guys have no idea how many hours this took me, this whole detour. But still, should be very good, and I'm pretty excited to complete some clue scrolls.
this game really doesn't want me to complete clue scrolls. All right, let's get five Shazy in favor. That should take like a few minutes only. Ladies and gentlemen, I may be the first person to officially leave Zia on the account. Look at me, man. I'm chilling in Varrock. The only problem is there's this fucker throwing potatoes at me, man. Yo, I'm gonna chill here for the rest of the tournament, man. Let's go. Ah, uh, here we go. The adventure of the heart clue scrolls on the this account begins. Let's see what we... Oh, <laughs> wait, we're already stacked, actually. We got a blessing, 31 nats. That is huge. Rune dagger that I can sell, slash alk, and some cash. I look like an absolute beast. Oh, I'm happy. That's gonna be great. I'm, I'm gonna keep, like, one pair of rune, but then I'm alking all the rest. And this blessing is gonna come in pretty handy, too. So, very happy with the first reward. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Another clue scroll is completed. Can we get something good? Oh, wait. That's huge. Wait, okay. This is a perfect clue. Firstly, best in slot gloves for range. Secondly, room plate legs, which means I have plate helm. I mean, full helm, plate body, plate legs. Okay, magic longbow. I still need to get the magic short bow. And 33 law runes. That's huge. And room long sword is an alk for money. That is awesome. How much... Ah, oh, fuck. I need 70 range to wear that. But that's gonna be so huge, actually. That's really, really insane. I'm so happy right now. Another clue scroll. After this one, I hopefully have enough money to where I don't need to open one at a time. But I really just want an MSB at that point. Then I can start stacking them. And... Yeah, hey, 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 uh, exactly what I needed right here, ladies and gentlemen. We got ourselves an MSB. Oh, that's a really nice upgrade. This maple shortbow will not be needed anymore. And this room plate body will actually be alked because we have one in the bank already. So that means we now have nice amount of cash that we can invest into feathers, for example, and go back to fishing if I want to AFK. But I think before I complete the rest of the clues, I do want to get agility to 64 because I'd like to have myself a talisman so I can teleport around the game. Unfortunately, I can't really do that right now and it's quite bad, but we look like a champion. Let's go ahead and get ourselves 64 thieving, I think it is. And uh, yeah, let's see if we actually completed any tasks as well. Uh, we did. How many points? 100 there. I don't even know what I did. But uh, yeah, let's go ahead and get our thieving levels up. And here we have it. 60 thieving, which is another task knocked out of the way. I'll collect it later. I mean, 1.7k points. It's gonna take me a while to finish those. Uh, but now, just four more levels to go until we can thieve the chests that I do not know how they are called, but they're gonna be pretty good for me to thieve, as I will have a chance of Xerician stuff and also the Xeric Talisman. So it's gonna be huge to be able to thieve those, but I still have four long levels to get there. I like it how at this point, even the game is telling me to stop. As you can see, I mean, obviously I'm just chilling, right? I didn't notice, but 98 strength and 89 HP, and ladies and gentlemen, just one more level to go and we are done with the strength training well probably not but for a little bit at least um yeah i've been logged in for a while man to say the least but uh what can i do that definitely took longer than i originally expected it to take but the most importantly we can now steal from the chests in the lizardman temple there's a couple of things we need for that first being a needle then some thread and then a chisel as well and some strange fruits to cure from poison and uh, those chests will give me some medium clues as well and they should give me some decent loot and hopefully a xeric talisman as well this will be my starting inventory. Ladies and gentlemen, we got it. Xeric Stalisman inert, but I only have eight fangs. But I still got it. So that's gonna be a task right here. Boom, equipping one of these bad boys. And that's gonna teleport me around the game perfectly. Now, I know I promised I'm gonna do clue scrolls, and I will do just a couple of more just to keep my promise. But after that, we're honestly just gonna start focusing on obtaining our last and fifth relic because that is gonna be game changing. On this account, I'm definitely gonna be choosing the two times experience one because on this one, 
we're gonna be going for a lot of 99s, maybe even try to max the account. Meanwhile, on our combat account though, we're gonna be going for the one that will basically in either increase my attack speed, most likely that one actually, the one that will increase the attack speed. I think it's gonna be huge to have that one on an account that has 99 all combat stats and stuff like that. Uh, but on this one, uh, we're going for all sorts of 99s and 2x is just gonna be too perfect to take. That's also one of the reasons why I'm not fishing anymore, because I can finish 99 once I do unlock that fifth and final relic. I think I know what I'm gonna be doing. I'm gonna stay here until 75 thieving, because that is going to complete elite requirement when I steal a gem from a gem stall, and that's gonna give me 250 points, and that's huge. And then after that we can do, for example, teeth, tithe farm, get a bunch of points there, and then just do all sorts of different things. But for now, let's set the goal to achieve 75 thieving. <laughs> I have to be the only person in the world that can miss 99 strength. <laughs> Whoops. Oh, there it is, guys. 99 strength. Easy accomplish on the account. I'm getting a little bit of extra XP. I don't know how much. I'll quickly check the high scores. Just so I'm rank 1. And then we're gonna start training attack. It's very late. It's actually 4 a.m. right now. So I'm probably gonna head to bed. I was waiting for this one. I was really waiting for it, and then I missed it, so, <laughs> yeah, uh, it is what it is, it's fine, I'm sure, it's okay. So, if I look at the strength, he has 13,237, so 13,237, I'm not getting 200k XP for a clip, there's no way, right, or am I? Nah, fuck that, let's train attack, let's train attack to 99, let me know in the comments if I should get enough strength XP to be rank 1. And the first trip is officially completed, 11k plus, if we put all of this in, 64 charges, that is huge. And uh, we used 12 thread, got a nice amount of diamond bolts, and now I'm just gonna do a quick farm run and then I'll return. We are now 69 thieving and also 49 crafting. So this is probably gonna get to 50 and this, as I said earlier, I need to get to 75. Oh, and I completely forgot to mention, only three medium clue scrolls, uh, you do not get an increased rate uh, of mediums from the chest there. So that's a little bit unfortunate, but it's still fine, um, yeah. Also, I do not need food because I have the four time HP recharge thingy, it is pretty handy. Pretty nice little milestone coming through there, 70 thieving already accomplished, five more levels to go. 50 crafting coming through, creating these salad robes, very nice. 72 thieving coming through and because I promised you guys that I'm gonna do a couple of clue scrolls I'm gonna go ahead and do a couple of clue scrolls. I'll finish these off a little bit later slash tomorrow um, But I do want to finish just a couple. Let's say one two maybe three hard clues um, Oh nice free teleport out just before I end the video since I promised it earlier uh, So we're gonna go ahead and do that once again pretty decent run and uh, we have 30 extra teleports so we have 94 teleports around the game that is absolutely phenomenal that's gonna help out speed things up easily so really excited to have that unlocked now and uh, yeah let's do some clues. I am just on my way to complete some clue scrolls before I end the video and we got rewarded with the book of knowledge once again we are putting all of these on hunter till the point where we can catch chins and there we have it 27 hunter very very nice. Now that we are no longer broke, we can afford a couple of things that I wanted to afford beforehand, but I just didn't have the money to do so. And the first thing will be, okay, somebody actually bought these out. Uh, or maybe no, maybe there's just 50. Oh shit, those get really expensive. I'll buy 20 soul runes, that's gonna be 20 teleports um, to the respawn point. And we're gonna go ahead and switch our spellbook to Arceus spellbook and probably stay on it for a very long time. Now if I ever need to alk something or do something on a normal spellbook, I can always home teleport, switch the spellbook, do whatever I have to do, and then go back there pretty much. So Arceus spellbook is gonna be the way to go on the account for the god knows how long. And here is exactly why we're gonna be doing this. Boom, spellbook swap, and now look at that. Battlefront teleport. And in the past, I would have to run this whole place right here, go on the boat, go to the mulch area, and then run here. Well, now, we literally just teleport, run a little bit, still a little bit of running, but it's so much better. And for every clue step, there is a basically Xeric Talisman that takes me almost there, so very happy. Let's finish a few clue scrolls and then call it a night.
here we go, I think we're gonna end the video off with three hard clue scrolls and then obviously in the next episode we are gonna be going for shit ton of tasks, maybe even more clue scrolls, just a lot of fun stuff. I'm honestly having so much fun playing leagues, but with that being said, let's jump into the first one. Oh my god, bro! <laughs> wait, wait, fifth, yo, yo, the, eh, that has to be the best clue. Like, obviously, there's other things, but 50 lore runes, that's, like, huge. You can't buy those. Oh, my God. Are you kidding me, man? Okay, two more. Ooh, 40 nets on top of that. Wait, and two plate skirts. Oh, my, I'm gonna have so much money, actually. And two more for Arma Page. Okay, this is one of the worst, actually. But, like, because it's just food, literally. This is useless. Oh my god, look at me go, dude. I'm actually a beast. I am kind of happy, I'm not gonna lie. That is, actually looks kind of sick. Alright, well, with that out of the way, um, I really do hope you guys did enjoy the video. Guys, if you made it this far in the video, let me know in the comments. Just let me know. I will respond to you. Thank you so much, and I'll see you again tomorrow with another video. And don't forget, we live stream every single day for about 6, 7, 8 hours, maybe even more. So make sure you tune into the live streams as well. With that being said, for the fifth time, I will now go to sleep and uh, have a good one, man. Bye-bye.